Hey guys, this is Guy Christian 9 and this is Pokemon Yellow. In the last part, we finished up Mount Moon, so we're finally in Cerulean City. So let's go northward and fight some more trainers. I didn't have you in mind! So yeah, we get to fight our rival again for the third time now. He, he wants to show us what he caught. And he actually didn't catch a whole lot either, sadly enough. So anyways, here's our third rival battle. Gary wants to fight. Gary, send out Spiro. So Spiro's gonna be the most powerful Pokemon in his party, sadly enough. Uh, just like last time, I guess. But now it's up to level 18, so he's definitely trained a lot since we last fought him. But, uh, you know, actually you can pretty much fight Gary probably right after you get out of Mount Moon. So, as you can see, like, I trained a tiny bit. Like, Pikachu was 15 in the last episode. Alright, so here's one of his new Pokemon, Sandshrew. Uh, we still don't have a grass or a water type, so we're just going to stick Butterfree out on it. So yeah, Sandshrew's, I think, his weakest Pokemon. If not, you know... Haha, <laughs> sleep powder. Now you are asleep. What? Woke up! What the hell is this? Alright, screw it. Let's just confusion it to death. Uh, as far as I know in this game, I think, um, in this game, the powder abilities are um, all 100% accurate. Um, you know excluding the sand attacks and all that. In, like, the later generations, they, um, powered it down a little. Like, you get about 70% chance of hitting in later gens. But I think in this gen, all, uh, every time you use a powder, it always sticks. So, it's very useful. Alright, so here's this other new Pokemon, Rattata, at level 15. So, again, another weak Pokemon, and since it's a normal fighting, it's gonna go down in 3, 2, 1. Ah! So anyways, now we're going to face Eevee, his last Pokemon, and since it's just like Rattata, I'm going to send out Nidorino, because Nidorino does double kick, so I want to give it a little action. Oh yeah, look at that sexy new Pokemon of mine. I believe this is actually, uh, well no, I think I used it against the uh, King Market. Never mind. So yeah, there we go, rival battle's over. His most difficult po Pokemon was probably either Spiro or Sandrew, if they got the chance to attack. So anyways, hey, we defeated him again. Hey, take it easy. You won already. So leave me alone. Hey, guess what? No. I went to Bill's and got him to show me his rare Pokemon. That added a lot of pages to my Pokedex. After all, Bill's a world famous as a Pokemon maniac. Or Pokemania. He invented a Pokemon source on the PC. So if you're using a system, go thank it. Well, I better get rolling. Smell you later. I never understood that one sentence. I know VG Cats made a hilarious rendition of it, but yeah, who cares? So anyway, now we're gonna finally go on to Route 24, and we took five steps in. Yeah. So now we're on the Nugget Bridge. Yay! That sounds fancy. Anyways, in this game, well, pretty much in every game. Uh, the Nugget Bridge is composed of five trainers, and if you beat all of them, they have they give you a nugget. And so I'm gonna sh I'm I'm gonna uh, start showing a new like. In the past, I've just been skipping the people who have you know old Pokemon, and I hate that how they always say all five of them say I did my best. I have no regrets when you beat them. It annoys the crap out of me. But anyways, um. I'm, a new trainer setup I'm going to start showing is that I'm actually going to show what Pokemon they have and not just skip it outright. Unless, like, there's a team that just, like, copies itself, and it does happen in this route. So, yeah, she had a Pidgey and a Nidoran, so, yeah, and I skipped her um, ending, so it doesn't really matter. Alright, so, anyways, now the trainer three, he's a youngster, I believe. So, yeah. Yay, Nuggets. Can't wait to get it because you really need nuggets in this game. Money is a bit hard to come by. So this guy has a Rattata and an Ekans and a Zubat, and he's down with Pikachu. Lol. Ow! Stomp's flat. All right, so all right, let's switch our Pokemon again. Now, as I was just saying, this trainer up here, this last, actually has the same exact team as the second trainer, the one with the Pidgey and the Neoran female, so I'm definitely skipping her. So yeah, there's no point to show her a repeat trainer. I lost two! Haha. <laughs> so anyways, now we're already on trainer number five! Haha. <laughs> so yeah, this, I think this battle is going to be pretty much just battling. I'll probably get to the end of Route 24 and all of its fun stuff, and then, yeah, save Route 25 for later, and then Cerulean after that. 
Alright, so this guy I think has a new Pokemon. Or at least one we've never fought yet. A Mankey! I don't think I fought a Mankey yet, so I'm showing it. So anyways, um, fighting types, we've never really explored their weaknesses yet. Uh, they have two weaknesses worth noting. There is Psychic, and there is Flying type. And that really hurts me. Probably gonna have to go heal Butterfree after this. But anyways, <laughs> yeah, he's down. Uh, Banky doesn't have really good defensive stats, though, and special stat isn't very good either, so, yeah. It's a weak Pokemon. So, let's go to this guy. Congratulations, you beat our five contest trainers! You guys earned a fabulous prize. Guy, you received a nugget! Yes, we're rich! Fair gold here! By the way, you want to join Team Whoa, wait, what's going on here? Our group dedicated to using evil to use Pokemon. Well, I just said that. Are you sure? No. Come on, join us! No. I'm telling you to join! Screw off. Okay, you need convincing. I ain't gonna you can't refuse. Oh my god, he's a godfather. So this guy's a shadow, like a hidden ninja rocket or whatever. He's gonna have an Ekans and a Zubat. And he's down. Lol. Yeah, you sure convinced us, alright? You convinced us rockets suck. With your ability, you can come out a top leader team rocket. And he just saves. Yeah. Usually they're just like. The screen fades out into black, and then he makes a ninja get away, but no, not this guy, he's lame. And oh my god, I got ninja again. I saw your feet from the grass. Well, why didn't you help me, you dick? Jeez, how rude, the nervous of people. So, junior trainer male, Rattata, and Ekans. More Ekans, a lot of people in this round have Ekans. I thought not. <laughs> Okay, so, I hit because people, they're gonna scared me. Ah, oh, you pussy. So anyways, going back to here, uh, this route is important because here you can find a few new Pokemon, one of which I will be using, Anish! Anish, Anish, Anish. Now, uh, the Cerulean is a water type gym. I'm gonna ha go ahead and spoil that now. And um, you're gonna want two Pokemon with you. You're gonna want an electric type, which we already have, Pikachu. And you're gonna want a grass type. Now, Route 24 has several grass types. Well, two grass types. Bell Sprout, which you just saw in my party, I already captured. And then Oddish. Now, um, whichever you're gonna use is pretty much dependent upon what your style is. Oddish knows, um, Absorb, which is a, a, one of the weakest grass type moves in the game, but it also restores HP, about half of what you get, I believe. I think. And then Bellsprout knows Vine Whip instead, which is, uh, doesn't recover HP, but is more powerful. Now, so, yeah, so whatever style you want for your grass side Pokemon will, you know, will determine which one you want. They both evolve at the same level. They have similar speed stats. Um, I think, um, I think uh, Bellsprout is less defensive, but more offensive. And then I was just like, more balanced, but it has better defenses. So yeah, there we go, Otis, the weed Pokemon. It was taken for a clip of weeds. If you tried to yank it out of the ground, it shrieks horribly. All right, so now we got Otis, and now a new Pokemon, yay. Okay, so one more thing we gotta do in Route 24. First, we'll get this item. TM45. And continuing the TM uselessness, that TM is for Thunder Wave, so let's talk to this guy. He wants to release his charge. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Don't release that thing! Oh, he's giving it to us. Hooray! We have a Charmander! Yay! And I guess I'll end the video here by showing off Charmander's stats. So yeah, talk to that guy! Free Charmander! Isn't this game awesome? So this is Guy Question 9. In the next episode, we will take on Route 25. See you later, guys.